Two very different lives came to an end this week. I'm John Stone Street, and this is The Point. In one of the great lines about God and man, St. Augustine observed, quote, You have formed us for yourself, O God, and our hearts are restless until they find their rest in you. Yesterday we reflected on Amy Winehouse, whose chaotic life and untimely death was mourned last week. But also passing last week was a much less familiar person, British pastor and theologian John Stott. Stott's stability and influence was a shaping force of 20th century evangelicalism. In fact, David Brooks of the New York Times suggested in 2004 that Stott was evangelicalism at its best, kind and caring but willing to stand on his faith and take it to the public square. Frederick Nietzsche once said life was a long obedience in the same direction, and that's true of both Stott and Winehouse, but the difference in their directions are a stark contrast between hearts that are perpetually restless and a heart perpetually at rest. I'm John Stone Street. Tell me what you think at thepointradio.org. <laughs>